Hey, hey, welcome to our channel, Tea Girl Magic Tarot. Here to do a reading for my beautiful J -j -j Gemini, my Geminis. What's going on, Gemini? Welcome to our channel. Thank you again for all your support, your love, your donations, your subscriptions, your likes, your everything, messages, emails, all of that wonderful things. I read each and every message. See all my messages and emails. Thank you, Gemini. I love you. Okay. This is a general message. It's not going to resonate with each and every person. It's not just a Gemini channel, but it is dedicated to the Gemini. So you do not have to be a Gemini for anything to resonate. Okay. It's just energy. So just take the energies. It could be somebody around you. It doesn't possibly have to be you. So choir, come to the front. <clears throat> One, two, three, go. T-girl, tarot, magic and collective. T-girl, 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 magic and collective. T-girl, tarot, magic and collective. Come check us out and see where we're about. Though. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, we are Gemini, 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 we sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. Yes, give the choir a round of applause. Hallelujah, hallelujah. All right, Gemini, what's going on in your energies? Okay, let's see what's going on. I'm going to use the, was it Mystical Moments Tarot? Um, should I get an overall energy? I want to get an overall energy for what's going on. Okay, so angels, what's the overall energy? Holy Spirit, ancestors, ascended masters, of the highest white light, pure love only. What is the overall message for in Gemini's energy? Okay, tell me what's going on, angels. Seven of Pentacles, okay, investing, okay, you guys are investing, putting in some, well, investing is the overall energy, okay, I don't know if someone wants to invest in a relationship, it doesn't have to be a relationship, but it's investing, okay, um, let's see what else, let me get a couple, two cards to see what else is going on, angels, holy spirit, ancestors, what's going on? Mm, investing some of you are planting gardening okay but you're putting in new investments some of you are going to invest in a relationship some of you are going to invest in a brand new job some of you are going to invest in the timing isn't right okay so maybe the, the to invest right now knowing these times of where we're in financially it's not the time to invest and spirits also saying it's not the time to invest in new love I'm feeling that a lot of you need to invest in yourself um, and your the new love is you. So start investing in time within yourself, okay? So the timing's not right. Whatever's going on, you need to do some healing. You need to do some cleansing work, okay? You need to in cycles. There's cycles in your lives that you're still not completing yet before you move forward and start investing in other things, okay? Now, if it is money, Spirit's saying it's not the right time to invest, um, maybe, you know, due to the market situations, okay? Um, what else, angels? Tell us what's going on. Okay. Page of Pentacles. Okay, what else? Page, message, probably wants to message you or make a solid offer. Uh-oh, here we go. So the Spirit is telling you, okay, somebody from the past is trying to creep through in this energy. Somebody from your past is highly emotional, highly, you know, attracted to you. Okay, they want to message you. They want to give you something solid. But spirit saying right now for new love, this person to come back into your life, someone you've ended out and completed a cycle with, right now is just not a good time to invest in this person. Okay, judgment's been called on this person already. Okay, and the cycle has been completed with the world card ending. Okay, so... Uh, a King of Pentacles wants to make this offer to you, okay? A Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo energy. They want to start off as a page, make a solid offer towards you. They want to express their emotions. They really have deep, passionate emotions for you, having their heart literally in their lap right now. They're playing it like a damn heart. Yeah, no, they don't. So this person is telling me they played with your heart before, okay? They put you on an emo emotional roller coaster, to make you feel that they really were into you 
when they possibly were just love bombing you, but now they want to make a solid offer because something has ended in their life, possibly with a new love that they have invested in and the timing wasn't right with that. So now they want to come back and invest in you. Mm, the Empress, of course. Yeah. And put in teamwork and collaborations, try to work things out, balance out things between you guys. Okay. Um, yeah, they want to balance things out between you guys. This person could live in a city. They don't have to. You could live in the city. Okay. Some of you guys could, yeah, picking up. Again, I don't know where I'm getting. France, New York. Okay. Europe. Okay. Hey, Europe. What's going on? What's up, France? Hey. Mm hmm The city, big city, New York. Okay. I'm even seeing Los Angeles. Hey, Los Angeles. Hey, New York. Yeah, but this person wants to put in teamwork and collaboration with you. They want to balance out the scales. They see that you are the star. They've been praying for you. It's one of the wish fulfillments. And now, is it a wish fulfillment what they did? Yeah, it's a wish fulfillment for them because they have the ace of swords. Now, they want to come and give you a solid offer. But right now, the timing just isn't right. We're going to figure out why the timing's not right. Well, for some of you, it's because you've already closed out a cycle and you don't go back from the past to start anew. Okay, you invest in, in other things. You've invested in yourself. You've had some type of awakening, some type of regrowth, a rebirth. I said regrowth. Well, that too, new birth. Okay, um, and it's caused a ten of swords to this king of pentacles. So the king of pentacles is in a ten of swords energy. Okay, um, I don't know. I'm just saying some of y'all need to get some dandruff shampoo because you guys got dandruff and itch, itchy scalp. Okay. Um, what else, angels? Yeah, but they're in the Ten of Swords, this King of Pentacles energy. Mm, tell me more about this King of Pentacles energy, angels. Yeah, this King of Pentacles wants to move to calmer waters with you, like I said before. Now, this King of Pentacles could be caught in a two a same-sex uh, relationship, okay? It doesn't have to be. Whether you be a male or a female, you're in this energy, okay? But whatever this King of Pentacles coming to you, Gemini, High Vibe, Cross Watcher, they are in a same sex or could possibly be are under a judgment for a same sex relationship. This same sex relationship is keeping them in the Ten of Swords because they want to be with their Empress and offer the offer their love to the Empress, okay? And make a solid offer to the Empress, but they're caught up in this same sex relationship. They want to move to Karma Waters. Okay, but they want to put in teamwork and dream work with you. They want to equal give and take. Mm. And under judgment. So they're under judgment right now. They're closing out a cycle with this same sex partner because they're tormented by this. Inner yeah, they're tormented, babe. Look, they're heartbroken over this same sex relationship. It's judgment's been called. Yeah, they're clasping their heart and they're spying on you. Whatever they see, it's touching their heart and they want to come and make this offer, this page of cups offer. And they want to put in teamwork and collaboration with you, but they're still in a third party situation. Okay, there's other lovers, but they feel that you are their soulmate. But wherever they're at in the same sex relationship, they're bored right now. Tell me more about the same sex relationship, angels, please. Gemini, y'all always got some juicy readings. I mean, it don't matter where, honey. Oh, Gemini. Uh, okay, this is the energy that I'm just picking up. So it's not a big deal that it's a same-sex relationship. It's a big deal that this King of Pentacles is not being honest about them being into the same-sex relationship. And they're getting judgment called on them. Something happened. What happened? The hangman. So this is why they're not probably moving forward to you. They're trying to strategize and figure out how they're going to move forward to you. How they're going to escape this this situation and they want to offer you a higher level of commitment but right now they're just trying to figure out plot plan and strategize waiting for their ships to come in okay to move forward to you tell me more about the same sex what happened with this same sex why why is it a judgment why are they three of swords because there was multiple lovers so i don't yeah there's multiple lovers or maybe one of the lovers was already married in a, in a relationship possibly yeah because i see the hierophant so the King of Pentacles is possibly, I don't know, the King of Pentacles. Now, if it's not a same-sex relationship, okay, because I'm picking up different storylines, this King of Pentacles is married, okay? But they do want to move to calmer waters to you. They're under judgment because their heart really belongs to you or they it really wants to be with you, but they're caught up. Whoever this other lover is, it's causing them a ten of swords. They're a heavy burden and they're heartbroken by it, Okay. Yeah, this King of Pentacles energy is being, yeah, they could be dealing with another King of Swords. 
Okay, they could be dealing with another king of swords. And so now they're drinking because of it. Okay, yeah, they could be dealing child with multiple lovers, more than two. They could have a, a Aries that they're dealing with, with this emperor energy. But I'm picking up the emperor and this king of pentacles is the same energy because they're both entrepreneurs, boss daddy energies. But they could be dealing with, the king of pentacles could be dealing with the emperor as well. They could be dealing with the emperor and a, a Gemini or an air sign. Child, ooh, the plot thickens. Lord have mercy. So tell me more about this, this father. Why? What's going on? Yeah, they're in the five of cups energy because something has ended. Now, what's ended, angels? Is has something ended between the same lovers in situation? What angels? What the hell? The king of cups, the queen of cups. So this is. A counterpart in the truth. So the truth. Okay, this is a divine counterpart. Whatever they're seeing, they're seeing you. They have realized that you are their divine counterpart. They want to marry the empress and give their, whether it be a man, this could be a female in her masculine energy wanting to come forward and marry you. But that's not the end. I don't know. Look, honestly, empress, because there's no sex in tarot. It's just energy. Whether you're the emperor or the empress or male or female, your emperor wants to make a forward movement with you, okay? They have a lot of love for you. We got the King of Cups and the Queen of Cups. This is a same-sex relationship, okay? Not for everybody. For some of them, it is a heterosexual relationship that the person that you're interested in or is on your mind, they are in a same-sex relationship, okay? You see the two women, but it's a king and a queen, okay? And they are in their head about it right now, this King of Pentacles. So, yeah... And they're heartbroken. Why is this heart? Why are they heartbroken over the same sex relationship? What happened in the same sex relationship? The t what happened? What happened in this ten of cups? I mean, this uh, same sex relationship, angels. I guess somebody cheated on somebody with a family, maybe eight of wands. I need to know. Hold on, y'all. Give me a moment. Cause something ended, and they're in regret over it. The whole thing. What ended, angels? What ended? What ended in the same-sex relationship? The five of wands. So somebody was, there was an argument. And then the nine of wands. So maybe they had an argument, okay, over you, collective, possibly. Don't have to be. What was the argument over, angels? Okay. What was the argument over? Moving away from moving the calmer waters towards you because your king of wands energy has passionate towards you. They see you as the counterpart, the king and the queen of pentacles. So this king of pentacles energy sees you as their counterpart, their twin flame, their soulmate. They're the one, the love connection. And they see a ten of pentacles with you. So this is what happens. So the same sex lover knows about it though. But the same sex lover, I guess things ended with the same sex lover because your person can't stop thinking about you, that you are the one they are supposed to be with. So tell me more about the, how is the same-sex lover feeling? How was in the same-sex lover energy? Why did they fall apart? Why did they break up, angels? The two of swords, okay? Secrets. I'm sorry, because the moon was under here. So they, 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 they split apart, two of swords, so somebody got cut. Somebody didn't make the team, okay? There's two... Yeah, somebody didn't make the team. Somebody cut somebody out for secrets. What's the secret? And the spirit said, that's the truth. So I'm picking up your king of pentacles, cut out that same sex lover. But what happened for them to cut? Was it really the, just the epiphany that they realized? Or is it something, an action happened? Um, Because it's different for all of y'all, actually. Because I guess, because everybody didn't. Yeah, your person said, no, I'm out of here. They literally made the decision to walk away and move towards you to a new beginning because you are this person's ten of pentacles, okay? Angels, why is it saying that the timing is right, is not right? And why is new love here? So for new love, the timing isn't right. Maybe this person needs to heal, cleanse their energy from the same sex person, okay? there's Like I said, there's nothing wrong but this person wasn't being honest and open about who they were and what they were about when they got with you. You guys had suspected things. You know, you know there was a strong deep soul tie connection. You knew it was something different that you guys couldn't get away from. Wow, that's kind of hard, you know, because I actually have a friend. 
I had a friend back in the day. This is years ago. Like, damn, how old am I old in my, yeah, I'm in my 40s. So this was in my teens. She was so in love with the gay guy. And I, his name was Alex. But Alex liked Pee Pee. But, you know, he loved, he loved the homegirl too. You know what I mean? Like, and they ended up getting married and trying to make it work out. But the bottom line was he liked Pee Pee. Okay? So maybe your person I'm feeling like really, I don't know. Tell me more, angels. They want to offer to you. They want to make. They want to message you. They want to offer you. They want to say I'm sorry. They want to work it out with you. They want to move to Karma Waters with you. Yeah, but they're toxic. Oh my God. Tell me what the devil is, angels, because this is the devil's addictions. The devil is addictions. It's a star. Okay, so the healing. The oh yeah yeah. So the devil in the star. And they're feeling left out. Okay, so the star is usually a wish fulfillment. Okay, this person, okay. Your king of pentacles is toxic. They could be a Capricorn energy because the devil is a Capricorn, okay. But this this person still is, is, is they're not honest. They, they have a lot of toxic habits. This person could be very obsessed with you. They do want to heal things with you. They want to move forward. They see you as the star. A lot of you guys could be healers, nurturers, okay? Your wishes are being granted right now, okay? So how is Gemini feeling all about this? So what I'm getting is somebody from your past, this King of Pentacles energy, is having nostalgic memories. They're in regret. They probably just broke up with the same sex lover, and now they want to get back with you because... They're in the five of pentacles right now. They can't stop thinking about you. You are their empress. They see how you've grown, how you're nurtured, how you're loving. They wear their heart on their sleeve for you. They can't get you out of their head. They want to marry you. They want a higher level of commitment with you. And they can't stop watching you. Okay? You put them in their head. Okay? They're in their head over you. And they're fire. They want to jump through hoops to be with you. Because you, they, you, honey, you put, they set, they set this person's heart on fire. It is your emperor. Okay, so, I mean, the emperor goes both ways, okay? It is what it is, but how Gemini feel about all of this? How Gemini feel? Gemini, you feeling like, oh, hell no, nah, nigga. No, nah, cuss, okay? Not that you, you know, you are against any of that, you know, but you just, you are the, you are the choice. You are not the option, and that's what's, that's why you were like, no. You feel foolish for even dealing with this king of, uh, pentacles energy because of the secrets that they kept. They ended something between you guys and ever since they ended it between you guys both of you guys have been in the five of cups but the king of pentacles more so in the five of cups and the three of swords because they've been so confused and ever since you guys have left and they've broken up with you they've been holding on to you. They've been holding on to you. Okay so why isn't the time right angels? Tell me why the time isn't right. Okay, because somebody just walked away from each other. They're single now. They need to heal, okay? They need to rest. That's why. It's not good from jumping out of one relationship going into the next without healing. This person still needs to heal. You don't need them to bring their heartbreak and their baggage and their fucking five of wands energy into your relationship, period. But Jim and I have a feeling that, okay, so how was the outcome, Angel? Tell me what's the outcome and I'm going to ask some questions. Oh, shit. So the night it fell right over here with the Ten of Cups and the Star. There is healing, okay? The Nine of Cups is wish fulfillment. That was the outcome. But for some reason, this King of Swords energy going to try to step... Look, they're going to try to block some shit. They are this King of Swords, so the same-sex lover. It's going to be different for everybody, okay, you guys? But the same-sex lover... What? Tell me what's going on with the same-sex lover. So your person broke up with the same-sex lover. The same-sex lover ain't trying to let go, okay? They not. The same sex lover looks at your person as wish fulfillment. Okay, your same the same sex lover feels that they're being left out in the cold. Okay, your person feels like the same sex lover is toxic, or either the same sex lover is addicted and obsessed with your person, and they're not letting go and they're holding on to your person. This is a messy sticky situation. That's why the spirit said the timing is not right because this person needs to heal. They're hung right now. They're feeling foolish and stuck. All while they want to make this brand new offer with you, Gemini, and balance out the scales. They want to balance out the scales with you with the two of pentacles, the ace of wands and the two of pentacles. They want to balance those scales out with you. Oh, Lord. Okay, what else, angels? Tell me more, honey. Mm, yeah, this person trying to gather some courage and some strength up right now to communicate with you that they want to put in some work and apologize to you. 
Yeah, so how's Gemini feeling about it? Gemini, y'all already said no. Okay, but tell me more. <laughs> Gemini, oh my God, y'all got drama. Yeah, this person is trying to hold back their emotions, but they can't contain it any much longer. They have so much love for you. Okay, um, and they want to work on this with you. Okay, they want to work on this with you, but yeah, they want the new beginning, but it's such a heavy burden. It's a heavy, heavy, heavy burden. Why? Why is it a heavy burden? Because they're same sex lover, king of swords. Okay, it's holding is in the way. They're not letting your person go. That's crazy. So how does the king of pentacles feel about this king of swords energy, the same sex energy that's not letting go? Oh my God. Eight of Wands, they want to communicate. How is they feeling? The Eight of Wands want to come out. So they want, they trying to communicate. They've been communicating with this. They've been communicating with this King of Wands that they want to be with you because they know that you're their counterpart. Okay? So your person's trying to communicate. So they got themselves in a doozy. Oh my God. Yes. They got themselves in a doozy. They got them an upset. And they, look, your person, King of Pentacles, told the same sex lover that you're their Ten of Pentacles. They can't, they don't feel complete without you. Like they don't have, they don't feel it like, oh my God. So this King of Pentacles, this King of Swords is feeling used. Yeah, they feeling like I'm trying to, they want to get back now. They want revenge. They're like, how dare you try to play me like that? Hurt people hurt people. Oh my God. They must have got their prostate tapped. Hork. Okay. <laughs> no, yeah, I'm just saying. Ooh, yeah, he wants revenge so he can bring some balance to themselves. Now, this doesn't have to be a same sex. It just could be the opposite sex, but I'm picking up same sex and this, this king, this king of pentacles right here, this king of pentacles likes him some him, okay, or her some her. Yeah, oh, damn, Gina, yeah, so they want, yeah, they love your, that's, this king of swords is in love with your person. They look at them as the nine of pentacles child. Yeah, they're trying to slow things down so they can move quick. They want forward movement with your person. They do not want your person to stop things because they think that your person is their twin. We're the same. We are the same. We are lovers, okay? That's what you're, That's what's going on. Oh, my God, Gemini. Oh, Lord. Okay, so angels, what the hell? Mm. Angels. <laughs> what would Gemini's person want to say? What's on their mind? What does Gemini's King of Pentacles want to say? Um, so the timing is not right now. They're going through some things with the same sex lover. The same sex lover is not trying to let go. So when your King of Pentacles is going to try to move forward, they're taking a long time, but there is going to be forward movement. But I don't know, Gemini. I don't. Angels, what what advice do you have? What card? Give what card you have for Gemini. What what do you advise, child? What spirits say? Let go. Let go. Okay, they say let go. The four cups in reverse. Let go. Okay, let go of the situation. The timing is not right. Okay, they're confused. They need to get clarity. Their energies are convoluted. Okay. Um, and they don't know what they want. And you're they, you that's not fair for you to be teeter tottering back and forth between their confusion right now. So spirit is advising you to walk away. Okay. So what's what, what's on the person, what's on Gemini's person's mind? What would they want to say to Gemini if they could say something? I need to heal. Didn't I say it? It's not the right time. They need to heal right now. Okay, what else? Okay, you were always the one I wanted. You were always the one that they wanted, Gemini. I don't know why they got caught up in the same... What the hell? Because this person's a pleasure seeker. I hear pleasure seeker. Mm-hmm. Angels, why you got these cards flipping? They say, just read them. I want you bound to me forever. Wow. I told you they're obsessed. And I'm picking up this King of Swords energy wants your person bound to them forever. Okay? I tried to break you, but you're too strong. So maybe this King of Pentacles energy tried to break you. Or maybe this King of Swords tried to break the King of Pentacles energy to want them. But your King of Pentacles is way too strong. The love they have for you is too strong. Okay? They don't want to let go. They're not going to let go. They don't feel, they feel that you're their counterpart. That's a, this is a weird situation, right, y'all? I'm about to reach out to you, okay? So this King of Pentacles is about to reach out to you, okay? They need to heal, though. Remember that, okay? He's paying for the choices. I, I'm paying for my choices. I regret my past mistakes, okay? This person has childhood woundings that they haven't healed yet, 
okay? And they're afraid to tell you about the same-sex lover because they don't feel that you'll ever love them again like, like you used to, okay? And this person didn't tell you either because they're running from themselves. And they want you to know that you were the best thing that they ever had, okay? You were the best thing, Gemini, that they ever had. Of course you are. You're the lovers. You're the best love ever. Durr. What else, angels? And then we're going to end this. So, yeah, you guys, that's what's going on right now. It's not for everybody. But I do know some females that do accept all this this, this craziness. You know, I'm going to need you to... Uh, uh, I can't let you outshine me. Mm, maybe this is like the King of Swords energy. Oh, they don't want you... But you do outshine them because it's in the reverse. So this King of Swords is trying to outshine you. They don't want you to outshine them, but you already outshined them though, honey. Yes, because your king trying to run back to you. Mm -hmm. I'm embarrassed about my life right now. This person's embarrassed about their life right now. Yeah, and I said, I hope you forgive me and take me back. I hope one day you'll forgive me and take me back. Okay, so this person's also saying, I'm not ready, nor will I ever let you go. Okay. And one more. This person says, I really miss making love to you. Now, I'll be, look, look, huh. I'm just saying, y'all be careful in them streets now. Okay, Gemini? Don't let these words fool you and bamboozle you. Know you, they got a king of swords or some kings on the side, honey, some emperor or something. Just be careful, y'all. Okay, what's love got to do with it at the end of the day? Just like Tina Turner say, okay? So, okay, Gemini, that's been your reading. I hope this has helped. Just remember the timing is not right about this new love. They need to heal, grow, and evolve to be better than they were the day before. Okay, I love you guys so much. Until next time, bye.